Greetings everybody, my name is Kevin Jonasik and welcome back to another Challenge Swift Challenge Swift 311 for North America and we have Horde of the Nighty Savages Frenzy Barb Let's go Alright We got the full set, we got two pieces of the Augils We got one legendary gem that critical hits for uh, and does bleed for 3500% weapon damage we got the Ring of Royal Granger, which actually tops off both sets that we're wearing. And we have Bastion Revert, which gives our friends a 10 stacks. Okay, so... The build is pretty straightforward. What I want you to do is, like, when you walk into your in the Rift, activate War Cry, activate Threatening Shout, and Wrath of the Berserker. Activate your Battle Rage. And then, with your force move and force stand still, walk around the map and then just keep whacking. Just keep whacking away. Also, keep sure that your bell rage does not drop below 25. Right, without further ado, let's get into the rift. Alright guys, here we go, challenge rift 311. So we open up on a pandemonium. Basically, what I want you to do is like activate your war cry, activate your threatening shout, activate your wrath of the berserk, and here we find our first blue. And then basically, hold your force move, hold your stance, force stand still, and then just basically keep pressing that frenzy activation. Activate your battle rage as well because your battle rage is gonna do most of your uh, multipliers. And basically, all you have to do is like walk forward. Here we find the yellow, and then basically. Just keep following the road and then another yellow. Keep, be careful because it's a grotesque and he dares to uh, kill you instantly. Alright, here we go into the big chain, into the big platform here, and then we click on the power pile and then basically we just go forward. Alright, here we just keep going forward and here we'll find a blue pack which will actually die instantly. And I saw just that I forgot an orb. Make sure that you collect all your orbs, that's gonna keep your time even shorter and now we basically all you have to do is like go to the next floor all right here on the next floor you'll find a channel and pylon right before the next yellow be swift in killing him because it's an illusionist and they have a tendency to multiply utterly annoying all right now once again on to the next yellow here also it's an illusionist make sure you make quick work of him and then all you have to do is like just go to the next floor if you're lucky and you go to the next floor you still have a little bit of channeling left use that to, for your sprain to keep your um, your fury up and then basically just keep going all right here we go out of the chamber and then just keep going up all right guys also early access diablo 4 came out i played it and i must say the game is amazing Alright, we're back to Diablo 3. Uh, here we find another yellow and then basically just go to the final floor. Here on the right you will find a blue. Then just keep going forward. Again, activate your war cry and your attracting shot as often as possible to keep your fury fully active. Here you find another yellow. Be careful because he has a tendency to explode. And then basically just move forward. In the fight, we're in the final stretch of this challenge rift. Grotesque, be careful. And all you have to do is like walk over the bridge. I had to go up a little bit, so make sure if you come from that one yellow on the right side of the screen, take the upper bridge because that's where the, ye the yellow is, and that's gonna save you like a couple of seconds. And then basically go over the bridge, go up because there's yellow on the left here, and then just keep bashing away with your frenzy make sure that your bell rage is constantly active make sure that your threatening shot is active your war cry is active activate your breath of the berserk every single time you can and who do we spawn we spawned sand shaper and all we have to say to sand shaper at the end is see you next week dude
Alright guys, so you just saw me clear in Challenge Rift. Uh, it's pretty straightforward, it's pretty easy. Um, just keep your uh, level rage up and you will never run out of fury, so you're basically just clean sweeping through it. Alright, thank you all for watching. Have a good one, stay healthy, and catch you all later. Bye bye!